Many analgesic drugs are currently available, for example, to relieve headaches, muscle pain, or joint pain, as in the case of osteoarthritis. With so many options for pain medication, certain types of pain respond more to specific medications than others. Therefore, it is important to choose the right and effective medication to treat your pain. Of course, each drug has its pros and cons, but there are specialized experts who will help you choose the most effective type for your specific condition. The first person you should consult is the doctor, an expert in different types of medicine, which can often help you find the most appropriate treatment for your pain. If the pain is severe, then the doctor's role comes in determining the cause of the pain and the appropriate treatment for it. Over-the-counter analgesics are usually used to treat pain of mild to moderate intensity, and prescription medications are usually more powerful. In any case, the pain reliever of any kind or severity should not be used except according to the instructions of the doctor. Although many pain relievers rely on pharmaceutical drugs to reduce pain and inflammation, there are also non-pharmacological products, meaning that they do not contain effective drugs, but their effect is usually to cool or heat the affected area to reduce pain and swelling. In addition to analgesic medications, there are many non-pharmacological treatments that may help relieve pain, most of which rely on heating and or cooling the affected area or joint. The heat relieves pain by increasing blood flow to the area affected by pain, which may be the back, for example, and it also relaxes the muscles of the mentioned area. As for cooling, it affects the large nerve fibers, temporarily numbing the pain sensations that are sent to the smaller nerve fibers. Cooling can also reduce swelling and inflammation by constricting blood vessels, so ice is often recommended for sports injuries, such as tearing or stretching of ligaments, muscles in the knee or ankle. Pain is the human body's first warning system. It protects you from the environment, from yourself, and from yourself. As we grow, we develop pain receptors in most areas of the body. These sensors are reagents that are specialized nerve cells called nociceptors, the nociceptors, that extend from the spinal cord even your skin, muscles, joints, teeth, and even some of your internal organs, just like nerve cells, they generate electrical charges and send information from their location to the brain, but unlike neurons, damage receptors work only when they feel that a person may be hurt or when he is actually hurt. Postoperative Pain Relievers Severe pain after surgery can usually be successfully treated. Modern pain relievers and anesthetics can control postoperative pain and then help your body heal. After surgery, work with your healthcare team to make your recovery as quick and pain-free as possible.